beautiful Saturday morning, afternoon, here in Pennsylvania. I have another yabo. I've got a yabo. I've got a yabo. Da -da 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 -da. It is unopened per the first lady, Mrs. Cobb. I did have a bowl of Ramsgate Esoterica in my stubby spindle earlier. Check out this beautiful setup. Look at that. Isn't that nice? It's gorgeous. So this one is from Mr. Ronan Piper from Louisiana. We're going to cut this baby up with my buck knife. It's the only knife I've got. I need to get another knife, that's for sure. I like this knife. It's my everyday use kind of knife. I kind of know what's in here because we were talking on Boxer about um, some uh, Virginia blends. And he was going to send me some goodies. Oh, put my dad going knife away too soon. Choo-choo go by first. Not smoking anything right now, but I do have a cup of mud. Alright, it's pretty much by. So here we go. My favorite Capstan Gold Navy Cut. Look on. Do it. Just look on to it. Kind of looks like navy flake, except a little darker. Ooh, that smells really good. There's one in here I'm really excited about trying, and that will be coming up here soon. I'm really excited about trying it. And tobacco pirate flake. It's a Virginia. It's a little bitey, he said. He noted some of these. If it's got a heart on it, it's one of his favorites. And if it's bitey, he said he put on that on there. One I'm supposed to sip real slow. Mm. Well, you can really smell that nice citrusy and grassy uh, flavors in it. Dan Tobacco Pirate Flake. I like Dan Tobacco. Um, their Limerick is really good. Now it's a vapor but um, I really like it. Dobie's Circles. Oh this is the one that's kind of like Peter Stokeby's Bullseye Flake which I love that. Obviously I had a bowl of that yesterday. So um that would be good stuff. I apologize for the First Lady not being here with the El Presidente, but uh, she's getting ready to go shopping today. Today is grocery shopping day. So uh, she's getting ready for that. Oh, here's the Bruno. <laughs> hey, buddy, here are a few of the tobaccos we talked about. Capstan is my favorite. Remember, if you decide to order some, it's the yellow tin. Hope you enjoy. Sincerely, Jason. Thank you, Jason. I do truly and truly appreciate your friendship and your kindness. Uh, we even talked this morning for about a half an hour. <laughs> so we have another flake. Ooh, a vapor. Salani flake. Look on to it. Just look on to it, as old Bergie would say. 
Now that smells really good. Man, dang. Okay. Mm, that, that reminds me of Brighton. Esoterica's Brighton. Oh man, that is so good. That smells delicious. Holy cow, dude. You sent a pile of stuff, brother. Another flake. Oh, this is the vapor. He told me this morning this will put hair on my chest. <laughs> I gotta be careful with it. It's Rat Trays Sterling Flake. It's dark. Boy, that's really dark. That almost looks like dark fire. It's that dark. Oh yeah, you can tell that's gonna be a bite. That's gonna be a punch. Yeah, that's gonna be a kidney punch. That day you're gonna have to smoke on a on a full belly. That's for sure. I really like Rat Trey's Howl of the Wind, so I'm anxious to try something else of theirs. Here it is. The one that I've been wanting to try. Cornell and Deals Briar Fox. It's a crumble cake. Oh, that looks delicious. That is really cool looking. I wanted to order a tin of it, guys, but I was just afraid. You know, I hate like heck to order something and not like it, but. Hmm. Smells leathery. It's that Red Virginia. I think it's Red Virginia in it, maybe. I don't know. Well, that smell is odd to me. I'll have to look and see what's all in that. Well, that's first. I'm going to try that right away. So I am. Jason, my man, thank you so much. Now I have your address, so that only means one thing. It's an open war. Thank you, brother, for all of your kindness. I truly appreciate it, guys. Um, thanks for tuning in. To my subs, thank you very much. Uh, if you are not a subscriber of Ronin Piper, go to the, hit the button, go down the steps into the basement, Walk around there underneath the workbench there on the shelf. There's a couple of uh, names and links. Find that link that you want. Ronan Piper will be in there along with a couple other shout outs today. I'm going to shout out some veterans today. LaDon Mott. If you guys haven't watched LaDon Mott, he is a cool cat. He's been around for quite a while. Um, has some health issues. We've been praying for LaDon. And, um, you know, he's just a good feller. So, sub to Don Mod if you haven't. If you have, go back and watch one of his videos and leave a nice comment. And um, the other veteran that I want to shout out today is going to be one that you probably have heard of, but you don't really hear very much of. And that's Calvin's Corner 72. Calvin's Corner 72. If um, you haven't subbed him yet, Go down there to the basement, like I said, under the workbench there. There's those links laying under there with some names on it. Find his link, hit it, give him a sub. A great fella indeed. Guys, until we can get together and pack that pipe or smoke a great cigar, let all what you do be done out of love. Y'all take care and God bless.